Hi, Dyslexic Genius here. I'm back on the Brunswick machine, but this will happen to any phonograph. Say you put the whole thing together and you got the center of the spring and you got the arbor through and you got to hook up and you go, oh good, it's hooked up, everything's grabbing, I'm good to go, put it, assemble the motor. But then it keeps slipping off. The spring keeps slipping off the arbor, the nipple, the thing that holds the spring in the center. What happens is, if you look closely at this, you see we have a nice gap right in here. But over on this side, this one's shorter. Ah, this side's grabbing, but this side's not. What happens is, this is just, when the factory did it, this one's just a pinch too low, and it's not letting the spring come around and grab. So there's two ways around this. Well, how come that looks all hammered down? Oh, it, it's been beat on too. And you can see here we have this, these nicks in here and stuff. So what, what you can do, one is you can sand this part down and take a punch and tap it out just a little and then check to see if it holds. Or you build a whole new one of these. And how do you build a whole new one? You go over to the Grizzly lathe, and we chunk in a piece of steel and we machine a new one. And that's how you do it. Yeah. And then how do you get it to stay in there? You, you drill the hole out and then you make the shaft part that goes into the arbor, this long piece, about two thousandths an inch bigger than the drill bit you drilled out. And you have a press fit in and you tap it in. And then when you're tapping it in, you make sure that here's the top, it's coming down. Okay, th this is going to work. Or you have a piece of e extra spring and go, yeah, it'll hook now. And this was kind of driving me nuts a little today. I put the motor together and went, bink, took everything apart, hooked everything back up, put it back up, dink. Okay, now I know what it is. It's, it's frustrating, but this happens. So we have another hour or so of work to fix this and get the Brunswick motor running in top shape. And that's my tip for the day.